Let's go. Come on, let's do it. Come on. If I win, you sub to my YouTube channel or you watch the rest of this video. Let's do it. Stop running. I, I want to tell you, stop running. Stop running away from God. Stop running. Stop running away from God. Stop running away from Jesus. Stop running away from the Holy Spirit. Stop running away. It's, it's, it's no wonder people run away into the world and away from God. Even 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 I have done this. As, as, as a believer, I've ran away. I've ran away from ministering to somebody through the Holy Spirit. I've, I've, I've just walked away. And, and, and we need to stop being scared. We There's so much boldness that can come on to you. How do you not have that boldness? How are you not bold? Stop running. Stop, stop running away, you know, stop running away from God's plan for your life. Stop running for his will in your life. Stop running away from helping others. Stop running away from loving others. We are here to love others. This, it's really as simple as that. And you know this, like it's, it, it, it's the general rule. We're here to love others. So stop running away. Stop uh, Love that person if you can. Love them while you can. Love them while you can. Help them while you can. Talk to them while you can. Talk to them about Jesus Christ, the Lord and Savior, the way, the truth, and the life. No one comes to the Father except by him. So why are you scared to share that? Somebody may have not heard that. I'm, I'm talking to myself right now. Somebody may have not heard the good news. Share that with them. Just just break it down to them. You didn't even, even got to go into every single thing. You got to open the whole Bible and just try to read every page. All you got to do sometimes is just, you know, Jesus died for your sins. You know, we all are sinners. Me and you both. We've all done wrong. We all make mistakes. We're all humans. Stop running away from that fact. Stop running away from that fact and walk in it. Walk it. Walk it out. Yeah, walk it out, bro. Walk it out, bro. Like, you you got this. You you got this. I I I, I think you got it. I, I believe in you. Um, just stop running away, bro. It, it's it's so easy to just walk away, pick up pack up your bags, and and later on feel the shame of it. Later on, you're feeling that shame in that backpack that you you carry, and it's just getting heavier and heavier and heavier as you walk until you unburden yourself and you you come back to the place. Where you should have been in the first place. Don't run away. Don't run away. It's it's always there for you. Um, God's always there for you. Um, he he provides. You know, and and this life we live in, it it's it makes it almost glorified to just walk in sin, walk in darkness, walk walk in that shame, walk in that guilt, walk in discomfort. There's no comfort in the world. Let's be honest. It's a real cold world out here. It's a real cold world out here, you know, and God is a refuge. He's a home, um, but it's a home that has responsibilities. You have you have things to do in God's house. <laughs> you don't just get to chill and kick it. I want to just say that I don't want I don't want you to think this is like some prosperity message or anything. I just want you to know that God's always with you. You know, no matter what you're going through, He's with you in that. Uh, whether you you gotta go down the street and help that homeless person. You can give him the last couple of dollars out your out your pocket. He's with you in that. He's watching you do that. Actually, he's watching you do that. <laughs> you know, and I don't know what you're going through. I don't know what you've done or what you can do. But I know at certain times God will be proud of you for it. if you're doing good or his. If I want to say if you're doing something according to his word. I just wanted to reiterate that. Um, something according to his word, you know. Um, and if you obey his commandments, that's that's loving others. You know, that leads you to love others, obeying his commands. And they're not easy to obey. <laughs> this life, this life we live, it's like there's almost like this 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 want for rebellion and the disorder. And it may get you somewhere. It might even get you somewhere. I'm not going to lie to you. It might get you somewhere. But what happens when you have kids? <laughs> what happens when you got kids if it, if it leads you somewhere? And then then you want them to obey you. And, you know, you was living. You got to set an example. You got to set an example for yourself. You got to set an example for yourself. You got to set an example for your past self, your future self. You got to look at it like that. You got to set that example and stop running away 
from yourself. Stop running away from the, the plan. Stop running away from the will. Stop running away. Stop running away. Stop running away from God. Stop. Stop running away from reading your Bible every day. Stop running away from praying. Stop. Stop running away from building back up those good habits that you had before. Stop running away. You could start today. I'm out here robbing everything, but you could start today. You could do that. You could. You could make your way towards better days. Don't run away. Don't run away. You. You. There's so much work to do. There's so much work to do, and and the sooner you start, the better off you are. There's so there's so much work to do. Um, Jesus says the the harvest is plentiful, but the laborers are few. There's so much work to do. There's so much work to do, and it's good work. It's good work. The the payoff is immaculate. <laughs> I, I don't know if I'm supposed to put it like that, but eternal life. That poof. Stop running away and, and 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 allow yourself to be led. Follow Jesus. Follow follow his footsteps. Um pick up that Bible if you need to. Help that person, you know? Uh go to that small group, go to that Bible study. Um go back to the places you're scared to visit, you know? Um go to those places. Go to those places that, that challenge you and make you make you just look into life look into look look into life the, not the life of sin but the life of light look into it <laughs> study it study god's words that oh we oh we oh we magooey i said oh we magooey oh man don't run away, man. Don't run away. You You could be almost you could be there. You could be there right at the you could be right there at the finish line, bro. And you ran it away. <laughs> you could be right there at, at the start and you ran it away. You could be right there at the start where where it all starts, you know? And you're running away. You, you could be right there. You could be right there. You could be right there. You could be right there at being the one who saves your family. You could you could be right there. You could you could be right there. You could be right there at being being the one who changes your community. You could be right there. You could you could be right there. So why are you running away from that? Why why aren't you aren't you following what you know? Why are you running away from what you know is good and right? Why are you not walking in the steps of integrity? <laughs> 